The industrial action embarked on by the Academic Staff Union of Universities on the 15th of February 2022 has grounded academic and business activities in the tertiary institutions across the country. Puff TV crew visited Ekiti State University for on-the-spot assessment. The welfare director of the student union government, Comrade Ebenezer Isaiah, expressed his frustration over the strike. Students feel delay, like, and most of, especially the under level that just resumed, most of them are not happy. Being the fact that you are coming from home and you just had strike is commencing very soon. So they feel discomfort and most of the students are not happy, most especially the final years. Some people are expecting themselves to graduate probably in the next two to three months. But hearing ASU stuff all around, all of them just feel destabilized. He said students are the most hit by the strike and pray that the dispute is resolved soonest. For Olarewaju Okwandemoye, the situation is a dicey one. He believes that the strike, if sustained, may lead students into crime. We are not happy with the situation on the campus and a lot of students have uh, traveled to their various um, houses. So I think that is really affecting the educational system in the school. The duo of Rachel and Deborah, who are final year students of industrial chemistry and political science, cannot hide their frustration. Angry! Angry! They should let us do and let us just go and let us leave, let us leave this school. I'm tired already. We spent how many years already in this school? They should just let us go and beg. My advice is for federal government to please consider our students and answer, attend to ASU's needs. Because, you know, all this is just affecting students negatively. So I will advise them and beseech them to please attend to ASU's needs so that we can come back to school. Business owners on campus also count their losses. school. <laughs> Get Ekiti State ASU Chairman Comrade Kayo Diarogundade was unsuccessful as he confirmed that he was out of the state on an official assignment. It is the prayer of most Nigerians that government and the academic staff union reach an agreement soonest and campus life restored. Idowa Debumi, Puff TV. People of the Fountain.